tonight's episode, Ashes to Ashes literally descend into the bowels of a home that is believed to be haunted by an unknown dark entity. An entity that prefers to remain hidden in the home's basement, only to manifest itself long enough to terrify unsuspected family members, and sometimes even visitors to the home, before returning to the soil of the basement dirt floor. One such incident occurred when the family hired an electrician and his helper to upgrade the electrical in the home. One day while working in the basement, the man's helper, without word or warning, dropped everything he was doing, ran up the basement steps, out the front door, jumped into his work vehicle, and fled the property tires squealing. Not only did this man not return to the house, but he also quit his job that day without ever revealing to his boss exactly what he saw in the cellar. The family has since boarded up the basement door to stop it from inexplicably opening on its own, even after securing it with a hook and eye lock. They have also pressed a blanket against the bottom of the door so they wouldn't have to see the shadows that walk back and forth at the bottom of the steps. Tonight, Ashes to Ashes will attempt to confront the dark presence that gets off on terrifying the home's occupants. Tonight, Ashes to Ashes calls out The Terror in the Cellar. Ashes to Ashes, you are all Hey guys, welcome back to Ashes to Ashes, and if you're new here, welcome. Um, tonight, I think you're really going to like tonight. We're not even sure what to think about tonight, but um, we were told about a basement of a house. We had slightly uh, mentioned this in the last video, about a basement that was uh, haunted. We were talking to the homeowner about the basement, and uh, as you uh, heard at the first of the video, we've got some crazy stuff going on here. Um, like the door is actually boarded up from the inside you can't get in it but it's boards everywhere because it was opening on its own uh, they have a towel at the bottom of the door they have it there so they could stop seeing the shadow shadows that were moving in the basement when no one's in there and the, the biggest story <clears throat> that caught my attention was uh, they had uh, some work done here and when they had the uh, electricians in there was the guy that was running the company and one of his helpers and uh, shortly after they were here the helper ran upstairs ran past didn't say anything to anybody ran outside started the work vehicle tore out of here squealing and didn't say anything and come to find out later he had told his boss and he quit that day he quit never came back to the business and he ended up telling his boss that uh, he saw something that night and he wouldn't tell him what and he said he'll never go back and he's done with the business so whatever that is <clears throat> there's a good chance we may encounter it tonight so uh yeah so let's do this guys
here. Okay. Okay, guys, we're downstairs now. Um, no shortage of creepy at all. And as you can see, maybe it is cold. But anyway, um, we'll show you around here. Hopefully, uh, we can capture something for you guys. And hopefully it's not too dangerous. Um, yeah, let's have a look. So, yeah, um, the family is really freaked out by this basement. I get like, uh, kind of dizzy. <clears throat> I get a... It's like, um, it could be the white too that's doing it, but it's like I'm Maybe. Kind of swaying. Um, the family told me that, uh, whenever they get a, put something down here in the basement, that they don't actually come down here. They open the door and throw it down. They will not come down here. So, I'm just gonna take a walk around. If there's anything here I'd like to make its presence known, you can say something, show yourself, or Hit something. Hit something. Hit something. You know what, Chris? That lights out challenge is going to be nasty. <coughs> Speaking of lights out challenge, guys, we're going to start doing something. I, had, if you uh, follow us on social media, I had mentioned briefly kind of teased about uh, doing something different in our videos. Did you hit something? Did you move? I heard... No, it wasn't water. Actually sounded like something like kicked the wall but with not a lot of force. Anyway. <clears throat> um... Yeah, tonight we're going to try, for the first time ever, I've been waiting to do this. Um, I modified a camera, uh, action camera, to uh, see night vision. And I made up a little rig of my own using the action camera and a, like a little security camera um, that, has, that I'm using for the actual uh, the IR lighting. So stick around towards the end of this video and every other video we're going to from now on be doing a lights out challenge. Not really a challenge, just a lights out thing. Um, we're going to we're call it um, hitting the shadows. Mm -hmm. So when it's time to hit the shadows, the only thing that me and Chris are going to be able to see is a little two inch... Something's pulling on my shirt. <laughs> something's pulling on you? Yeah, totally. right, you're standing right where I heard it. Not strong, huh? but they're like yeah. All right. Well, I think we're waking something up. So yeah, we're only gonna be able to see a little two-inch LED screen, you know, on the back of an action yeah. camera. We won't be able to see actually anything. So you guys are really gonna have to, if you would, if you don't mind, watch it. Um, point out. Um, point out. Um, point out anything. Big time. Are you? Tangles. Anyway, stay tuned for that. So that there is what I come up with. Action camera mod it to see night vision, our night vision source, and I've got a couple battery packs to run both, so we can use it anywhere. Made a mount, old computer monitor. Anyway, if you guys want to know how I made it a little bit further, just. Hook me up or, set, or hit me up on social media and I'll let you know I'm doing Chris's uh, tomorrow. So we'll be have we'll have two cameras to use for night vision.
When I was down here, like, it's moving around. So I'm getting, like, charged up, and then it goes away, and then charged up, and then goes away. You know what I feel? Um, pressure on my ears. Like a lot of like pressure, almost like uh, like if someone's holding your head underwater. Not, I'm not choking or uh, I can breathe. But it's that pressure on your ears you got. Okay. It's in grids, like gritting. I am gonna have my flashlight in case we hear something. No, that was okay. <laughs> okay, we're, okay go we're, done. <laughs> we're going in. We're on standing right now, guys, is where I just heard a few minutes ago like something, something kicked the wall. And we're passing a, passing a threshold here where Chris said he just got a couple tugs. So, where we're going now is a separate part of the basement. Um, yeah, it's like a split basement. Let's show you. Kind of like a work area. Is there anything in here that uh, doesn't want us here? going to come down those steps guys from the outside that's an old uh, like an old outside wood shoot door but um, it's covered in snow and ice so we couldn't do that we had to come on the inside and they had to move the boards for us to let us down yeah this is the new side where they did the renovations so so no one usually down here to see or talk to you what? Batteries on the stove. That's nice. Like. Flashing already. Yep. Jeez. All right. Hopefully we capture something in the pictures. I took another one. So, as I was saying, no one ever likes to come down here and. Uh, confront you or even say anything to you but we're here now and here's your chance enough people have seen you enough people have heard you you scared an electrician. You scared an electrician enough to uh, make him quit his job. Care to try that with us? And guys, I don't mind provoking down here. For the simple fact is, um, the upstairs has been cleansed and sealed. And they've tried it down here. It doesn't work. Whatever is down here is not leaving, but it's never went upstairs, so by me provoking or whatever, which I don't do very often, um, <clears throat> I'm not worried about it going upstairs and harming them, and if even if it did, they know how to. Uh, so I wouldn't put any family in harm, but they told me it was fine because it's never come upstairs after they cleansed it. But they said there's certainly evidence of it being down here. Try scaring us like you scared the last guy. <clears throat> we won't. We're not going to run like the last guy did. Are they? Mom? No. Like, not bad at all. Okay, Chris is going to start at the portal lap, guys, and we're going to see what, uh, what happens. So, where are you at? That is the app turning on, guys, if you heard that. Well, here you can use this app, this device I have in my hand, to talk to us. If there's anything you want to say, 
I know you've been clammed up for a while. Feel free to speak through this app. Dave? No. Yeah. Chris? Not just saying okay. <laughs> two names. Jesus. Right off the bat. Ow. Is there anything you would like to tell us? That's the plumbing, guys. Rose. That's, voices are sounding different than what they usually. Is there anything you would like to tell the homeowners that now live in your house? That's weird. <laughs> That was deep. Do you like the fact that they live here now? Sad. Why are you sad? Dead. It's Menol. It's Menol? Menol? It's French. Are you sad because you're dead? Do you know you're do you know you're dead? I can feel you touching me. I thought it said yes. Me. Where are you touching me? <laughs> Something just grabbed my hand. Mm -hmm. Woohoo! It was touching my back. It's oh, like, there's something right here then. Something's got to be right here. Something just put their hand like... I can't show it on camera. My hands are freezing. Like someone put their hand under mine. Like help me hold in this light. Yeah. Are you happy that we gave you a voice finally to talk? I don't think it's nice though. What what nice would show itself to someone and scare them so bad? Oh, I don't know when I stopped recording. My camera cut out again, guys. I gotta start paying more attention to that. What I was saying, what Chris was saying is maybe um it was trying to show itself, and that guy wasn't ready for it, but... Gene was what? Gay. Gene was, was gay? Um, but where there's been renovations going on in this house, because they did a lot of work, chances are that probably ticked off where in the a spirit or two. Are? Like, uh, you can see the renovations have been the ongoing. Um, they said they don't like this side of the basement. Where in this basement do you like to hide? What did it say? In front of you. In front of you? In front of you. Well, I think there's something... What am I holding? They might not know. This is a com This is a computer. Is you so you can talk through. That's a computer. That's what it almost sounds like. I'm going to come over here. Demonic. Demonic? Is that what I said? Yeah. See, I told you I don't think it's nice. Right. I really it's don't. It feels different though in here than what it does I know. right there. This is super, super cold. It is. You can tell the difference. In there, it's warmish. What you that? I know. I was hit stuff hanging off my face. It's not spider web though. I know. It, it felt weird. It wasn't sticking to my hand when I. But it was in front of my face, and I was like, "What is that?" Who resides? Who resides in this part of the basement? It said something there. The something, yeah. yeah. Could have been witch or... Them. Them. How many? 20? How many are there? What's your name? Who's the main spirit here?
Sure. Is there one spirit that rules the rest here? Ooh. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. We're only here for a little bit. You can talk to us. Give us some information you want to let maybe our viewers know, people upstairs know. My hands are freezing. Like. <laughs> There is something standing like right here because my yeah, hands are my, like ice um, this, this hand's warm. The hand I'm holding the camera with, cold, cold, cold. Zach. Zach. I heard that name earlier on there, Zach. I just didn't point it out. What about Zach? Can you give us a sign that you're like right with us right now? Could you move? There's that um, thing again. I'm going to stand back from this guy so you know it's not me. There's that thing again. Um, it's, I know. It's like a... It's there, but it's not there. It's not yeah, a... It's not spider web. Right. I thought it was too, and I couldn't even... Like yeah. Like, it was right in front of my face over there. You probably seen... Probably I was it. probably on the camera showing myself trying to pull it off. That's probably it. Can you move something down here? Like really definitively Give us so a knock, a bang. Maybe move this. Insulation. Heck you can even throw something if you want. There's cans on the ground over there. Can you kick one of those? Just once. I know, I heard it too. Those steps shouldn't be creaking, but they are. You can draw energy from one of our batteries. I'll turn something on. <laughs> I gotta make sure I brought my extra battery in. Uh, yeah, I did. I brought the extra. Got an extra battery this time, guys, in case. This one dies quick like it did the last house. You can draw energy from my flashlight. Give us a knock. Give us a bang. No time to be shy now. What was that? <laughs> so what happened to you? If How did you die? Or where did you come from? Were you ever human? Down? What is that? What? Does it say something? No, I heard something like in my own ears. It's like, whoop, 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 whoop. Did you? There it is again. You're hearing something? I'm not hearing it. Listen. Oh, that was me, guys. It's like super, super light. I still get pressure in my ears, so this may be where I'm going. No, I, I heard it like. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I wonder if that'd be like that. Don't laugh at me, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Could have been a cry, like an old. For someone. Maybe. A whale, like an old. One. Holy cow, it's cold. Let's hit the old side. Oh, it's so much different over yeah, here. It is big time. So I, much different. It's almost like. But this is where my ears are getting the this, most pressure on them. This part over here. Yeah. Shouldn't have been. Messed with. On. Yeah. And maybe that's what could have stirred it up. Probably. And this old, this is old stone and brick and. Yeah. Could be holding it's like just demon. Walking. I just heard it say demon. Just walking in there is like super, super cold. Very. I mean, I know it's. Are you a good spirit or bad spirit? Half human. Half human. Alright. So you're half human. So are we getting a good side or are we getting a bad side of your half human?
I can feel my anger level like mm -hmm. really, really rising. I wish my ears would pop or something. Because the pressure is ridiculous. It's like irritation. Just, I want to, I want to provoke it more than what I should. Go ahead. I am just trying to minute it a few minutes ago. Step forward and say something definitively to me to let me know that you are here. You're not impressing us very Show much. Show yourself. Deep voices ain't gonna do it. Right. So far, we're not impressed. I'm getting more than one down here. There's that that smell over here. I was feeling or smell feeling it. I was smelling it over here. Yep. That stinks. Do it. Yeah, do it. Do something. I was saying do it. Get what? I'm gonna, since that's where the new panel's at. There's a good spirit down here, step forward. Whatever's keeping you, whatever's keeping you back has no power over you. You can do what you want, or permission. If you're a good spirit, like Chris said, if you're a good speak, spirit being held here, against your will, you're free to leave. Say no, or don't, or something. Did you hear that? We gave permission to the good spirits to leave whenever they feel like it. So, I'm not sure where that electrician would have been standing. But this is definitely a new panel yeah I'm just gonna stay here for a second just to see <clears throat> maybe you don't want to do anything with the lights are on but in just a few minutes we're gonna turn them off and uh, if you want to impress us maybe you don't care But if you want us to leave, leave you alone, you're going to have to let us know. Because we're not going to leave you on our own. You can touch my neck all you want. You getting touched again? Yeah. Why are they after you? I just had my hand touched. That was it. <clears throat> I want them. Oh, that was me. Make sure I didn't break nothing. <laughs> going to leave this house eventually. That's right, the person upstairs knows how to get rid of you. Or keep you at bay. It's not your house. It was your house at one time. But there's a family that's here now. There's no evil spirits, no bad spirits, demonic spirits allowed in this house anymore. So what do you got to say about that? We know you know that we're here because you said our names. The first two things that were said on that device was mine and Chris's name. So I know you know we're here. I don't even, I don't even want to ask nicely, I'm just, no, I'm, I'm, I think I know what you mean, like, I don't feel like being nice here. No, at not all. at all. Every other place we were, you know, 
just my irritation level, like it's just gone up. Like yeah, I just don't feel like lot. being nice here at all. So I don't think there's whatever's bad here outweighs the good. just said what was that all right so what was that I said demon you know what I believe it I really believe that's what's here no so what Chris was just saying guys the camera shut off again sorry um what we're seeing these little it's like he Chris described it as like a like a ghosty cobweb we can't grab a hold of it we can see it but we can't grab it and you probably see me messing with it and Chris was messing with it trying to grab a hold you just can't grab a hold of it and I'm going to show you what the actual cobwebs look like down here how thick they are like they are very definitive cobwebs that's not what we're seeing it's like a I want to scream like <laughs> like where are you? Like I, I know. really, really want to. I know it's here. Oh, I know it's here too. I know it's here, and I don't even know if it's just one. Bite my tongue. Yeah. So yeah, whatever it is, it just keeps. Hopefully, the camera scene when it was in front of my face there, what, what I was, what I'm talking about. Okay, guys, we're about to. Uh, Try our little experiment, and we're gonna go lights out. Um, now that oh my gosh, it's cold over here. His back, his back. Uh, we're gonna go lights out and uh, see if anything happens there. So, really, this little screen we're looking at, we're not gonna see much. You guys are gonna see everything, and I won't see it until editing, but. Uh, we're going to get ready and do that here in a second. Or over there. Yep. I just heard a footstep. Wait. Over there. Like a... a it's moving like around. A squishy. It's like, yeah, it's like moving. Going, 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 going. Let's go over. Just... Ow! i got to stop hitting that thing. That was me. Oh, breathing right beside me, Chris. I know the camera must have heard that. It was like. He's tapping over here. Now, I can hear it over there. What? Did it? Chris's flashlight just got tapped on. What was that? <laughs> Sound like a snarl or something. Maybe we're finally ticking it off. Have we been here too long? Well, we're not leaving yet. Listen. Were you affecting my emotions? I'm hearing what's like something sneaking out with squishy footprints. It's like is that you trying to sneak up on us? Is that what you got to do? Sneak up on us? You got breathing? There's some loud over there. We are going to uh, hit the shadows, like we said earlier. Going to night vision, and Chris is going to keep the portal app running. Die. But it's he's not going to uh, use it as a light. He's going to keep it covered up. So the only we won't see anything. All right. Okay, guys. Um, obviously the uh, audio is going to be a little different because it's an action camera. It is impossible to see a 
Okay, so uh, we can't see down here anymore. So um, if you want to scare somebody, now's your time. Hear that? Mm -hmm. oh, that something just said something. I heard it, but I couldn't make out the rest of the word. So you wait it till her lights wrote to say something. Well, go ahead. Oh my gosh, that was loud. Right in my ear. So this is our first time using this, guys. So, um... I'll know from when I edit if I have to get closer to the camera to speak or further away. Hopefully you guys can hear. I can't see nothing. I'm going in here though. I just want to do it. Back. Yeah. Back. I can't see nothing. Yeah. Well, I just have that feeling that something's going to be right on my camera. You want to show yourself now? <coughs> oh, you're like scared me. I gotta make sure there's no pole. What was that? I know a lot of girls. You don't like this new sector being built, do you? Now when I look at that with my eyes and not the camera, yeah. it looks dark. Anyway, now I don't see it. Now I'm standing here and I just kind of moved, let my eyes adjust. Mm -hmm. It was just all black right in that, this corner here. But I, I don't see nothing on the camera. You don't like this new section being built, do you? Yeah, what do you think of this new, all these renovations? For you guys not familiar with how night vision works, it might look on the screen like we actually have a flashlight. But that's not, that's completely IR um, light. I'll show you the difference so you know we're not lying. There's our flashlight. Just to show you guys that it is completely dark. Alright, I'm going to try to over here. I'm seeing shadows everywhere. Like everywhere. Yeah, it feels like there's something standing right there. Ooh, I just got a bad chill. Yeah, I got one too. Oh, really bad chill. As you can tell, we can't see you, so you're pretty much free to show up wherever you want. Sure there's no it's not a trap. No, it's not a trap. We're not here to trap you. We're here to communicate with you. Well, I can really not tell how far. <laughs> not too much over there. Yeah. Okay. Um, guys, like we said, if you guys see anything we can't, let us know. Point it out screenshot it, um, send it to us, we'll post it on social media. Also, very quick, um, we also have a Twitter page that we just recently started, so if you guys prefer Twitter, you can go over there, we post some of the same stuff, um, and it's the same handle, um, at the ashes, two ashes, number two, that's and you'll find us there, we post things there, so if you want to go over there, yeah, come over and follow us, and if you prefer Twitter over the other 
Oh, let's. What's that? Which corner? Oh, that's a corner I keep seeing the dirt. Like a black mass in. No. Hold on, because I gotta get the brake on. Yeah. Can you see what that hole is right there? Yeah. I just looked down there and it looked like something hunched over big. Yeah. Just kind of hunched over, just sitting. Uh, actually, Chris, this was showing on the camera. I can't get my balance. That's my flashlight, guys, and let you know. What is Take your light off for a sec. Dude. Yeah. Right. So, why do I? That's where I was hearing the talking. No, it was like, a, like a, in the mud. Yeah, the footprints. I'm telling you, it was like something's following us. Yeah. Are you? It's probably coming out of it's there. It's over there again. Yeah, it's probably coming out, and even when it goes in, when it comes out, I heard that too. Yeah, you heard that? Yeah. And it's like, Let's go we're over. going to the right, and it's going to the left, and it's circling its way around. Yep. There's something over there, Chris. Mm -hmm. I can hear footprints. Now they're not squishy, it actually sounds like a foot. Somewhere. I'm gonna go back over where. Uh, my right one is cold. I can't see. I can't see. I'm just trying to see this little wee two-inch screen to try to tell where I'm going. But this corner bothers me. Something. Something fierce. Are you over in that corner? So, are you over in that corner with Dave? Can you show yourself if you're over here? Make a sound. I'm going to go around and show the other side of the corner. Which puts me right in this corner. I can see it. It's just You can see the shadow? Yeah. Good, I'm not the only one. Yeah. No. It doesn't want to be seen. No, I can tell. Now, no, guys. It's just around. Like I yeah. The reason they have that towel at the bottom of the door upstairs is because there's quite a gap there. There's about two or three inch gap. And it creeped out every time someone walked by that door. They could see a shadow almost moving back. Shadows moving back and forth here, plain as day, like there was somebody down here. So they end up putting that blanket up under the door, at the bottom of the door, so they couldn't see it. Give us a name. We want your name. As you can see, guys, Chris has the app, but he has it up against him, so we can't see the light from it. We're not cheating and using light. This is your last chance. Give us your name. Yeah. I can see that thing hanging again. Mm -hmm. just it's, it's just Zach. You can get a Zach. Zach? Zach. Uh, like it's yeah. like a fifth and sixth time now he's getting back. Did you die on this property? Did you die in this house? We? Oui. Anything? 
There's you die in this house. A demon. There's got to be something over there. There is. I can feel it. stuff. It's shifting back and forth over in that wall because we're over here. Yeah. You can't get to that back room, so it's just shifting back and forth up against that wall. Okay, <coughs> guys, we are positive there's something over here. And this would be the area. Well, this is where Chris is on the other side of these steps. This will be over in the furnace area. Did you see that? You got demon at the same time? Oh, do I ever got the chills. I think that's the first time I've been startled that bad. I seen something you guys almost look like it took off. Or Would you like us to leave? I'm going over. Zach again. Zach again, yeah. First of all, I'm going to look in this room, make sure nothing's hiding. Let everybody see all angles. Ooh, there was a light right from like a, a light by them steps, it lit up, the, like a light, not an orb, it was just like a light, like someone took their flashlight and hit the steps over there and turned it right back off. Are you making my hands bleeding? Can you show yourself in here? Yeah, I think it said, descent towards gate this. Yeah, ooh, someone put their hand on my shoulder. Someone put their hand on my shoulder. This is what it sounded like. It's, and you'll have to go back to try to get it. That's exactly what it sounded like it said. I thought it said, save it. And then I thought it just clued in. Something just put my other hand on my right shoulder. And that's over there. To the Here's your sign. Portal's talking to me. Yeah, I got my sign, but that, oh, that was creepy. It felt like the fingers were like 10 inches long. Was that you? As chilled to the bone as I am right now after that happening, I would much rather see you show up on my camera. I want proof. I need proof that you're down here. Because people can't feel what I feel. There's whispering over here. Uh, I'm, not moving. I'm, I'm going over, but I'm going slow. Just because now it's in here. The noise. Is it scraping? Doesn't want to be seen. Felt and heard yet. That's how you said his right. His right? Yeah. That's where I seen it, my right over there. Oh, I feel like someone just hovering around my back. I'm going to turn the camera around. Maybe where I'm not looking in that direction, someone else might see something. If you guys see anything behind me, let me know. I'm like, oh, frig is that? Oh, I'm frig. What? <laughs> it was right here. 
that was right here, right to the fire. Like right here. I think it's circle in the basement. Yeah, this this wasn't a shadow. This is like white mist, like right here. That's what I've seen on that step in there. It wasn't an orb. I'm not a big real believer in orbs. They have to be something special for me to believe that it was anything. 99% of the time it is dust or moisture. Are you standing right beside me a couple minutes ago? That over there was a light that formed on the stairs. Just seen that light too. In a like flash. It's just right fast, yeah. Yeah. Oh, right there. I'm just like that. It's not like someone took their, like a fingernail and flipped the stone. So, we are about to leave soon. Maybe we'll come back. Maybe we won't. I think we might. But if you don't want us to, Give us a sign saying you don't want us back. Jim. You got a face? Yeah. Yeah, there's something over there by them windows. I'm going to go over one more time. One more time. I'm. Last chance. You're going to go out with a bang or what? Or are you just going to continue to hide? Alright well. right, guys. Uh, we're going to wrap up here now. Um, let us know. Let us know if you guys seen anything or heard anything that we didn't. Even when I'm editing, I don't get to hear and see everything. Uh, most of the stuff it catches afterwards. And let us know if you like the new night time. Hitting the shadows, we call it. Let us know if you like that, because we're going to start doing that towards the end of every video. Because it just gives us that extra creepy factor. And it kind of leaves us more vulnerable. So, uh, yeah, let us know. Um, you guys like what you see share with everybody let everybody know about us it helps our channel grow the bigger we get the more places we can branch off and go to so all the likes all the subscribe all the subscribers amazing we love you all uh hit that bell yeah hit that bell so uh keep you up to date when we ever we drop a new video so yeah guys um follow us on social media like I said before you guys will kept, be kept up to date when we have another uh, investigation coming out anyway guys we will see you next time get your on guys